Previously on Berserker Bridged. It's long, long, it's big, it's heavy, it's wood. It's long, long, it's better than bad, it's good. We finally found their secret headquarters. Looks like the Hawks are about to get a bee in their bonnet. Big time. Damn it! will you quit it with this crap? Your name is Ted and you're a private third class in the Midland Infantry. But when night falls, I fight for justice as... THE KING BEE! Yeah, you do know that bees tend to die after they sting something, right? Quiet, lava lad. We must signal the rest of the hive using the intricate dance that bees use when they need to... ...say stuff. To other bees. Larva lad? Aw, oh, hell no! Enemy raid! We're under attack! Oh, what would Griffith do? Quick! You guys go that way, you guys go that way, and you guys go eat ice cream! Oh man, usually when Griffith says crap like that, we wind up winning! Help me! I I'm still alive, only I'm very badly burned! Honeybee Brigade, retreat! Ted just shut the hell up already! Hey everyone! Hooray! Got this back! I can't stop this feeling deep inside of me. Girl, you just don't realize what you do to me when you hold me in your arms so tight. You let me know everything's alright. Oh, I'm hooked on. La di da, guts is back. You know, I was just thinking that we were missing someone to sit around and sulk in a corner for three years and then disappear at the most inopportune time possible. And here he is. It's like Christmas all over again. Don't mind him, guts. He's just a ridiculously huge asshole. I was going to put it euphemistically, but fair enough. Look, we're just about to start the Griffith retrieval arc, and we could really use another pair of hands, swinging a giant sword. You in? Griffith Retrieval Arc, eh? This isn't one of those things where you have to spend 20 barely animated episodes jumping through poorly looped tree backgrounds before anything interesting happens, is it? Oh, no, nothing like that. It'll go quick, I promise. Okay, good. Then count me in. Just let me go say hi to Casca first. I'm sure she'll be just as happy that I'm back as you are. Five minutes later! Ow! What the heck? Right in the arm, man! Shit! I hate you, I hate you, I hate you! I hate you more than Mystic Quest, and the loading times on the PS1 ports, and several other things that I can't think of right now because I'm so angry! Oh, hey, what did I do? You left! You left Griffith and he fell apart and got himself arrested! You left me right when I was falling for you! And you left the Hawks and weren't there for us when we needed you the most! You're a stupid, selfish son of a bitch, and I want you to die! Wow. You really hate me, don't you? Yes, I really, really hate you. You want to have sex? Oh, God, yes. I will, I will, she signed to my request. Then she tossed her name, all my resolve was put to the test. was really nice, you know? Such a nice change for this show, too. I mean, no demons or prostitutes or underage kids, just two consenting adults making love. Yeah, definitely. So, now that we're, uh, lovers, there's something I kind of wanted to talk to you about. Of course, you can tell me anything. Well, I was kind of hoping we could talk about my, uh, choking fetish. What?! 
Yeah, I thought we could just talk about it, you know, kind of take it slow, and then once you feel comfortable, maybe try a few things. The safety word can be banana, and, uh... Okay, yeah, that's one idea. Here's another one. Let's never, ever talk about this again! Uh, are you sure? Because uh, I really don't think it's healthy for me to keep repressing this, and I thought maybe if I just had somebody I could trust to talk to about it that, uh... Yeah, okay, let me rephrase that. I'm going to try very hard to pretend this conversation never happened. You're going to help me by never ever bringing it up again. And if you're very, very lucky, someday I might let you have sex with me again. Got it? Oh, uh, well, okay then. <laughs>